Yeah, you know, going into this region meet, uh, you know, we need Holly to continue to be the leader that she's been not only this year, but the, the past couple of years. And uh, we need Carrie White and Audra to be right there behind her. We had a great one, two, three at conference. Um, the big difference of if we can improve upon our conference finish was uh, how our four or five do. We have to be a little bit closer there for our one to five split. I think we definitely need to go out like we did at conference and run like top five pack really up close to the front. I'm definitely aiming to be in the top five or ten girls in the meet and then I think the rest of the girls are just going to try to stay as close together as they can. Yeah, it would mean a lot to me. I mean, that's been a goal of mine for a long time and I just barely missed it last year. So to qualify this year would be awesome. Holly just she just needs to do what she's been doing. She's she's been so consistent all year. She's run great races. Her conference race to you know the highest finish ever by a cowgirl getting third, uh, beating some all Americans there. She she's running great. So she just needs to to not make this a bigger deal than it is and and go in there and run her race. And and obviously the lower she finishes, uh, the fewer points get added to our team score. So Holly's just going to do what she's been doing all year and run a good consistent race. It would mean a lot. We've never had a girls team go to the. Uh, national championships for cross country and we've been working real hard and it's been a goal of ours for a while so it would be really cool if we could make it this season. Yeah you know we're we're, you know, we're struggling through a little bit of adversity there um, a couple of our guys are are out or, or not at uh, you know the, the fitness they need to be right now uh, but you know most teams have that issue this time of year it's hard to get all the way through the season healthy and you know now we just got to stop feeling sorry for ourselves and go out there and, and end the year the best we can and so the mentality on their side needs to be you know let's go out there take some pride in who we are, take some pride in the team, and, and have as good a finish as we can for the program. Yeah, you know, I'm hoping he goes out there and runs as aggressive as he did at Washington. He had a phenomenal meet there, and if he runs like that, he's gonna give himself a shot to go as an individual. Yeah, I, I mean, you know, I, I think being the last meet of the year, uh, you know, at conference you go in there, and our big goal was to be in the top three. So occasionally you maybe run a little conservative back there at four or five, so one of those athletes doesn't have a really bad day. You know, I think going into this last meet, uh, if we have any chance as a team, we got to do something really special. So I think the strategy is take a risk and, and just see how good you can be on that day. And uh, don't, don't be conservative at all. And, and if, you know, in the end you go for it and it doesn't work out, then we'll, we'll deal with that at this meet because really the only reason you go to this meet is, is to see if you can go to the NCAA championships.